Hi folks, Jason here at Leisure Time Sales, taking a look today at a fresh arrival. This one, a Winnebago Vista 29V, and oh boy, what a camper this will be. So we're gonna do a quick overview of it. We've got some pictures on the website, but if you wanna get into some of the technical stuff about the chassis and some of the great features inside that I don't touch on today, please schedule an appointment with one of our sales representatives. We'd be happy to take you through this unit. So as we get ready to head inside, let's take a quick look at some of these outdoor features. We've got a beautiful outdoor kitchen in this one, all kinds of cabinetry and storage built in. You've got a fridge, a spot here. Uh, you've got a sink, you've got a spot to plug things in. You've got a um, bottle opener, you know, key stuff. You gotta have that. Outdoor entertainment, you got a TV with a stereo sound system built into it as well. So you can hang out outside the camper and really enjoy yourself at the campsite. If it's too sunny, if you wanna keep a little bit of rain off, you've got a full size awning over top of this unit as well. You can see the storage compartment doors here on the side of the unit, all kinds of room to keep things tucked away on the outside of the camper so storage is not a problem with this unit. So let's take a look at the inside of this beautiful camper. Take a look at the front first. Nice spacious cab. You've got uh, lots of uh, comfortable appointments there as well. You've got beautiful cup holders put all through the unit, uh, full safety features on the Ford chassis. We can get into some of the details of that when you come in to visit us folks. Nice big panoramic windows. Just imagine your view going down the uh, highway on the way to Florida or wherever it is you might be going in this beautiful camper. Uh, what a nice, comfortable setup. Let's take a look at the coach itself now. You've got a boost dinette in this unit that drops down to create a bed. If you need that extra sleeping space, you've got storage over top. There's one of what will be three TVs total in the unit. We already saw the one outside. Got a hat and wallet storage there, as well as a spot there to hang a few coats once you get to where you're going. Nice placement of the mirror there really opens things up, makes it feel a little bit bigger. Not that it needs that. It's quite a large coach as it is. Cup holders built into the table. Here's your comfortable spot here to uh, kick out and relax and watch that television. Some of that blur fix there for you folks. There you go. There's your kitchen. We'll take another look at the couch. Nice comfortably set up across from the television. You've got some storage above as well, some lighting there so you can sit and read in comfort. Two chamber sink, good size kitchen countertop here. You can see the solid state countertop as well. Love that, no tea molding around the edges. Really makes for a high quality piece. Mentioned this a few times, be happy to tell you about it when you come in to see this coach, folks. We were down to Forest City, Iowa to see how they build these coaches. They do a lot of their own cabinetry, a lot of their own furniture. Uh, just really amazing to see that 70 to 80% of the materials that go into these coaches are built uh, entirely by Winnebago themselves so they can control the quality process. It really is something to see. Three burner cooktop over top of the oven. You've got a microwave above, 12 volt fridge built into the unit as well. Good size for Travel, get all your groceries loaded up in there and you're ready to go. As we get ready to head to the back of the coach, we'll take one last look at the front. Again, all kinds of space there. And over top of the cab, we'll demonstrate this for you folks if you come in. That's a powered bed that'll drop down to just over top of the seat so you have another little extra sleeping space as well. There's a ladder at the back to uh, latch onto those two black spots there that you see, little hooks. So you can climb up into that bed and have an extra sleeping space. So really you've got room for people on the couch, room for people on the dinette, and of course there's the main bedroom at the back. As we head towards the back of the coach, let's take a look at the bathroom. Really good sized bathroom in this unit. You've got a side-by-side -side fridge with a skylight. Good counter space here, storage below. Corner medicine cabinet, little linen chest over top with a flush. And of course, a foot flush toilet. We'll close that up. You can see into the main bedroom now, you've got a king size bed, wardrobe on either side of it, storage above. Nice wood grain finish above the bed for the headrest. You've got little inserts on either side. I'd like to see that from Winnebago making good use of the space. You've got plugs in there as well so you can get whatever you want charged or powered by your bed all set up and ready to go. We'll come around here and take a look at the really, again, good use of space. And this is on a full size slide, uh, <laughs> bigger than full super slide on the side of the coach on the off camp side. Runs the entire length of the coach from the back of the driver's seat. but. What you see here is a uh, full wardrobe, six large drawers underneath that, a little spot there to set a few things, and a TV above, so there's your third television. So this has been a look at a beautiful Vista motorhome from our friends at Winnebago. 
we now have the best selection of motorized vehicles we've had on the lot in quite some time. Come on down and see us, folks. Leisure Time Sales, Chris Bamsis, our friends up at Leisure Time Sales in Moncton. Love to help you out. Find the unit that best suits your needs. Play matchmaker for you as you uh, head into the camping season. Have a great day.